All right. I'm here to talk about swing thoughts. Everyone seems to have one or zero or think you gotta clear your mind or only think about one thing or a bunch of things. Uh, I tend to try and think about one thing, but one thing has never worked for my entire life. So it's hopping from one swing thought to another to another. So I'm interested what your swing thoughts are. Comment down below if you're watching this and you have a good swing thought for hitting pure irons, pure drives, etc. Uh, I'm gonna go through a couple that I think of just to hit the back of the ball with the club in the direction of the hole. And if you've watched my channel, you know that's about all I'm good at. So number one is foot pressure. I think that trying to stay balanced, trying to push on your feet is essential. So my number one swing thought that I always try and do is to keep some pressure on the inside of my right foot. So from here, I'm thinking this line, I'm just pushing down on that line. As I come back, it prevents me from swaying too much. And if I can keep that pressure all the way to the top, then that's a good place to let go from. Always moving towards the target. Second one is hand position as I take the club away. This is something I've always done. I even heard growing up in high school that you want to have the dish up here that'll help you shallow, etc. Um, my hands don't work like that. I get flippy, I hang back and try and catch up. So the best way for me to keep the face on plane is to think about as I turn away from the ball and bring the club back, I have to turn counter to that with the club face. So as I'm going backwards, I'm turning this way. Not that extreme, but I'm thinking about this in my mind, trying to trace and if I can trace that, one, that keeps me a little more on plane this way. And two, when I get to the top, I'm not so open that I have to do something crazy to get back to the ball. And so for me, it's all about keeping that on the way back. All right, number three. Number three is one that I'm just now starting to do. I've had one of the watchers on this channel, three in one golf, I'll leave him below. I used to watch him a lot when I bought the OptiShot. Um, I guess he's out of Sweden, and he's been yelling at me to keep my left arm straighter because I like to get a little wavy and whippy. And so swing thought number three is straight left arm. If I can keep my arm straight, I know that I need to rotate to get to some sort of a good position to swing from. If I just keep my arm straight and try and keep all this steady, then I only get to about here and I hit my own chest. So the arm straight thing is good for creating some rotation and then try and keep the arm straight after we'll try and get this extension after the ball. So I've been working a lot on that. It's the three and one. And I'm just doing some half swings. Club head going in the right direction. Put it straight on. Okay, last one. And that is foot pressure again, back foot again. But instead of holding the inside pressure and just going forward. I want to get a little better at getting my heel into the ground and then pushing off my toe to go up. I have a problem of jumping towards the ball and getting on my toes to lean forward. And what I really want to work on is 
right heel into the ground and then get this to go up and down and rotate through. And it's a lot of timing, but I think that I can get there. And it just feels more natural. It feels a little quicker. And so those are my three and a half swing thoughts. Probably too many. Comment down below with yours. Let me know what yours is. If there's one that's really good for swinging from the inside, that's the next one I need. So thanks for watching the channel. Like and subscribe.